Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to add products on Big Cartel website in 2023. So Big Cartel is a fantastic platform for showcasing and selling your products online. Whether you're an artist, for example, a designer, or even a small business owner, adding products to your store is a crucial step to getting your offering in front of potential customers. So Make sure to stick by, let's dive right into this video and let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, you'll have to go and log in into your Big Cartel account. To do so, go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually going to use the Brave browser and of course in your case you can use any other browser that you could possibly have. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to this URL section, simply type bigcartel.com and hit the enter button. Once you do so, you will be taken to this home screen or main screen of Big Tech Cartel. If you don't know much about this, of course, you can always scroll down, read more information about it. And if you don't have an account, you can always click on sign up and you can even start for free always. Of course, as you can see, this is the price. And if you're interested to see, you can pause the video and see all the features that comes with each plan, as you can see. And if you have an account, you can simply go and click on login to log in into my account. Once you click on login, of course, I don't have to enter anything because I've already logged in into my account. So I don't have kind of to do anything. Here, as you can see, once you logged into your account or you just created your account, make sure to finish this getting started checklist. Now, as we said in the beginning of this video, is we would like to add products on our big cartel products uh, or uh, website. Sorry. So if you click on design the shop here, or you can simply go and click on account at the top right corner here as an example. And we can simply will be able to design our websites from here by clicking on design. Of course, we will be able even to change the URL of our uh, website if you want to, especially if we own a domain name, it will be very simple. So as you can see from here, I have one product. So how can I add more products in example? We don't have any option here to add products. So is it possible? Yeah, of course it is possible, but you will not be able to do it from here, from designing the websites. You'll be able to do it if you go back. As an example, go back to the dashboard. And as you can see from here, as you can see, I have add products option. If you go to products at the top options here, you'll be able to add more products. So as you can see, this is the only products I have. And because this is the only uh, one I have, uh, that's why, let me just open that in a new tab. That's why it's the only one I have here in my website. Of course, if I add more products here, the products will be added automatically on your website. So that's how you should do it. So as an example here, let me just close this here. Let's just go and add the products. Click on the plus button. As you can see at the top right corner, of course, you can click on more actions. Example, if you want to import any products, for example, if you have products from other websites, I've already made a video on how to connect your big cartel to Printful, to Printf, Printify, if you want to import some products from there, or you'll be able to import products using like a CSV file. If you want to, you can simply click on get started. Click on add a CSV file from your product, choose it from your PC, and from there you'll be able to add those products. Of course, if you don't have, sorry, so you'll be able even as an example to import products from other integrations if you want to add them. As I said before, I've already made a videos on how to do that. You can go and check that it's out on how to integrate it with other dropshipping like suppliers. So here I'm just going to click on add products at the plus button. First of all, we'll have to go and give the image or get the image of the, our products. As an example here, I'm just going to add like a Discord image for you. Make sure to add everything accurate. So here's an example, Discord PNG image. Uh, and now I'll have to go and give it a product name. So I'm just going to name, to name it test here. And of course, description, I'm just going to give like a random description. If you don't know like how to write a description, you can go and use like an AI tool like ChatGPT or something like that. You can ask him to write, uh, let's just do that right now, why not? So go to open a new tab, go to chat.openai.com and hit the enter button. And of course, make sure to log in into your account. If you have an account, if you don't have an account, make sure to go and create one. And simply here, I'm just going to click on a new chat and uh create an example i'm just going to ask him create uh for me uh, a description description of uh as an example uh, i don't know which products are we going to do as an example like uh a products like yeah i'm just going to like products description of like i don't know a digital products 
like a digital picture a digital picture product and hit the enter button and of course as you can see they will write a description for you if it's too much as you can as example as this one so make it uh, make it more shorter as example So as an example, this is a good uh, like description. You can go and take whatever you want on it uh, and simply go and copy that. Once you copy it, simply go and paste it here or you can go and enter your own description on that. As an example here, I'm just going to uh, uh, hand, sorry, handmade products as an example or something like that. So make sure to enter your own uh, description. Here in categories, make sure to go and add your category. So if you have some categories already added from you before, that will be good. If you don't, you'll have to go and click on the plus button. Give it a category a name. So example here, uh, I don't know, like digital products, an example. So products and click on save. And as you can see, you will be able to select. It will be able to select even more categories, not just one. And click on it. As you can see, categories, digital, digital products. The status is active, hidden, sold out, or coming soon, depending on whatever you want. So I'm just going to have active. The price, of course, put whatever price you want. For example, I'm just going to put 20 here. Variant, you'll be able to add any variant if you want to, and even variant group. And of course, you can even enable this inventory tracking. The shipping, of course, add the shipping price, depending on whatever you want. For me, I'm not going to add the shipping as an example here because it's a digital product so you can simply deliver it online but for you you can go and add your shipping of course a price if it's like a loan product or with others depending on whatever country you can add a lot of shipping options here so just delete that and of course for the us tax category make sure to simply go and add that if you're us citizen or something like that so once you finish simply hit the save button and okay this is already taken so i'm just going to add zero click on save and here we are now what we'll have to do go to accounts again at the top right corner and then click on design once you click on design here as you can see you will find the products is already added directly to your website without any problem so if you want to add products on your big cartel uh, websites what you will have to do go to products here and add as many products as you want and if you go to design those products will be added automatically without any problem of course from here you'll be able to edit the appearance of them however you want and of course if you want like some products to, to appear uh, before some things as you can see you'll be able to do that from here so example i want to display to appear the first if i go now to design i'll see that is appearing first as you can see so this is going to be it for this video. For each this point of this video, congratulations. And if you like this video, of course, make sure to leave a like down below. Subscribe to our channel for more t tutorials or for more helpful tutorials like this. And of course, if you have any issues, you can always go and reach the click at this icon at the top or, or bottom right corner and ask a question on this live chat and they will add, uh, answer you or help you however you want. So thanks for watching and um, well, I'll come back to you in the next video.